Demonstrations, explanations, and simulations. Sergeant Ellis with the Greensboro Police Department showed Mayor Nancy Vaughn and three city council members what officers do day to day. What we can and cannot do um, and, and the rights of those people. The council members wanted to learn more from an officer's perspective. The decisions that you have to make as an individual at split a split second causes some of these you know, some of the action. So I can understand now from police. This training is timely considering recent calls for police reform across the country. A lot of the issues and challenges coming towards Greensboro City Council right now are concerning uh, police, police, you've heard a lot about police reform. Just last week, the council considered a change to police policy. They didn't approve written consent, but they did agree to inform citizens of their rights before a search. Us as elected officials, it's a little hard for me to say that I can change a policy for a department such as the police department because I have none of that expert training. That's what the training was all about, to get an inside look at how officers go about making the decisions they and do so the council can also make informed this. decisions. I, I kind of saw it a little bit more from their perspective. Um, I understand the community and the community's concerns about not being over-policed, but in hearing um, that police do not come to work with an intent to harm, it was very comforting. Mental health was a big topic and so were tough conversations like the use of excessive force and how officers investigate those cases. Several more sessions are coming over the next few weeks, including a ride along with police.